I was looking at my planner and as I was crossing out the days that already went by, I have 60 more days of school left, like school days. 60 school days left. <laughs> what? Oh my God. Literally time is flying by so fast. I'm, where is, I'm gonna go. 60 more days of senior year. Like, this is not including weekends. This is just, like, days I'm going to school. I have 60 more days to go to school. Whoa. <laughs> like, I'm not even joking. Today is Tuesday. I had off um, for school. But 60, 60 more days. And I have a concert on Friday. Oh, my God. Because then in March, hold on, I'm just going to show you. In March, it's a relatively short month because... My spring break starts on the 20th, that Friday, like after school ends, it was when spring break starts. So I have like these two weeks off. Birthday party is going to be moved to the 11th because I'm spending time with my family in New Jersey. Literally, March is going to go by so fast. I know I'm going to have a ton of assessments. They're just not in here yet. And then, then it's April, May, and then in the early days of June. Whoa, no, this is crazy. I have to start prom dress shopping. I have to start prom dress shopping and looking for venues for my graduation party and literally getting everything together. Oh my god. <sighs> I was not prepared for this, like, at all. This really puts things into perspective. Oh my god. I have to get on top of my ish. <laughs> I'm just gonna finish studying for my psych test on Thursday and working on my biotech paper because I'm not doing that last minute. So let's just get on it. Let's be productive at 8.50 p.m. on a Tuesday. How are you okay. feeling? How are you feeling in terms of the concert on Friday? Sophia has a solo, by the way. I'm not feeling good at all. I'm nervous. <laughs> I'm like, what's going to crack? Um, what else could go wrong? Everything. I'm going to be out of breath. I'm going to pee myself. Oh, maybe myself? don't. What if I sweat so much that like you can see the sweat? <laughs> um, I'm going to forget the words. My voice is going to crack. That's the biggest thing. My voice is going to crack. It's going to go weird. It's going to go funky. And it's good. People are gonna be like, oh my god, this was the worst girl ever. So I have to go. Okay. You well. know, you know, one girl. <laughs> she keeps going. <laughs> you know, Gilmore girls. Like, yeah. Rory interviewed. Rory wrote that review at Yale for the um, I'm a ballerina. Mm. The ballerina said, die jerk. What if that happens to me? And somebody writes a review of me because I'm that bad, and I have to tell someone to die jerk. Okay. <laughs> well, that was. It's actually gonna be so bad. Oh my god, I'm not ready for this. So basically, I got home and. I went to Dunkin'. I got my, what is this? A toasted vanilla latte, I'm pretty sure. Um, I just tried it, it's actually really good, but I figured I needed a little bit of caffeine to get me through today because um, <laughs> I have so much work to do. I <laughs> And I'm a second semester senior, guys, like, come on. <laughs> the senioritis is really, it's really hitting. I'm about to get started on my homework because I have to study for my psych test this tomorrow. I have to work on my biotech paper due on Monday. And I have to um, 
continue research for my history paper, semester long paper. I have to do regular homework, like my English reading homework and just a whole bunch of other stuff. So I do have a lot of studying to do in terms of like my psych test, because it's one of the biggest tests that I think this is like the biggest test that we've had. So this is like a really big test and it's all about the biological knowing neurons and also di different parts of the ears and the eyes and the brain just literally every <laughs> every biological thing that has to do with psych so yeah let me get started on that because it's already like four i just came home um it's raining i got rained on because i didn't have an umbrella and i was wearing the wrong jacket for today so it was actually like hailing like pellets of ice were just being flown at my skin like it hurt so anyway, <laughs> I'm just going to start my homework and I'll just update you guys later. Yeah, I am a hater. It zoomed in right on your That's face. That's so disgusting. <laughs> Hi. Okay. <laughs> Today is Tuesday and I'm at home early because we got a snow day yesterday. Well, we got a snow day. We got the email for the snow day that's today, yesterday. Um, so yeah, it did snow and I'm so glad because I really just didn't feel like going to school today, but I still have so much work to do. So, I mean, when do I not have work to do? All my friends, we were like crossing our fingers, hoping that we would have a snow day. Today, I have to do a lot of research. I have to do a lot of research for my history semester long paper. I have to start working on my biotech presentation. I have to finish my English book that we need to finish for class. And I need to, I, mean, I think, do like one reading for psychology. But I'm at home today. Yesterday, I started to buy um, the decorations for my birthday party and i cannot believe i literally cannot believe that my birthday is it is on sunday like this coming sunday it's literally on sunday and i just i don't i can't believe that i'm turning 18. like i don't know if that makes sense i just can't like i thought i had so long until my birthday but i'm going to be 18 on sunday and that's just crazy to me so i'm not having a birthday party this weekend but i'm having it the following weekend on the 11th which is a saturday and I don't want to give too much detail as to what it's going to be like, but it's going to be super fun. And I'm so excited. I'm just going to get started on my work. And I think it's like 12, 1, it's 1, because I had a late brunch or it was brunch. Um, But yeah, and now the snow is melting, which is really, oh, it actually, it started snowing again. I don't know if you can see that, but like it started to snow again. Yeah, I'm just going to get started on my work and maybe have some time to relax later. Finish Outer Banks because season three, I think, is so good. I don't know about other people, but I think that season three is so good. So many, so many surprises. So many surprises. And maybe I can do some reading today. I don't know. Oh, I should, I should record an episode for my podcast. That's what I should do. And answer emails. Yeah, I have a lot of stuff to do, so let's just get on it. 
Dreams of being young and unafraid But I love somebody and it drained all my energy Ooh, and I thought that love was magnificent I remember being seven years old Thinking, oh my God, what's it feel to be 23? Now I'm 27 staring at a kid in the mirror And all I do is wonder if he's proud of me Broken promises made me this way, I swear I wasn't always numb and indifferent Bartender, I need one shot of whiskey But what could I tip you to refund my innocence? and I'm at my grandmother's house and today is my birthday Sunday March 5th and I'm 18 which is even crazy to say like I, it doesn't feel like I'm 18 at all but on the agenda for today is finishing my biotech presentation going to Starbucks to get my free drink and then going to dinner with my family so right now I'm just getting in the shower um it's like one but i just wanted to like go in the shower now and then get ready kind of and then i don't know just take on the rest of the day i don't know so i'm just going in the shower now and i'll update you guys when something more exciting happens because right now is not exciting but i've been receiving lots of really nice messages on instagram and through text and just like my friends are really awesome but even people who are like not really my friends have been like reaching out to me and i feel really grateful for that so yeah okay so this is the dress that i'm gonna be wearing it's a strapless pink ruffle dress and i'm gonna be wearing gold heels with it and some gold jewelry so this is how i'm looking before i go to dinner the face and jewelry and i'm not wearing shoes right now so i'm not going to show you my feet but the dress is really cute you can't really see it but yeah <laughs> Get 
tryna get you on, maybe we can relax But you keep flaking on me So don't mind how I look right now because um, it has been a long day, but I just wanted to come on here and show you some of the birthday presents that I've been getting so far. So the first one I did get was from Sophia and I got a coloring book, markers, um, a squishmallow and candy and I'll show it to you in a second. Hold on. Let me... So this is the squishmallow. It is a banana slug and I searched up a real image of a banana slug and I was horrified but this is cute <laughs> and then she got me these um Crayola super tip markers because I really like to I really like to color and she got me like an adult coloring book hold on my thing is a whole mess um so I started coloring and then she got me this basket it was all wrapped up really nicely before but she got me like it was yellow. The theme was yellow, if you couldn't tell, because um, it's my favorite color. But she got me candy and some chips that I started to eat in this cute little basket. And then Kayleen, she gave me her gift to me today, and she got me a literal skincare fridge. It's a multi-purpose fridge. You can use it for like actual food items like drinks and beverages, but you can also use it as a skincare fridge, which is most likely what I'm going to use it as. So look at how cute this little thing is. It's giving me like Smeg appliances, you know? I just unwrapped it. Um, it's a personal chiller, but it also chills and warms. So really, this is really, really cool. I'm gonna take this with me to college for sure. Hey guys, it is Saturday. I have one more week of school before spring break, which I'm so excited for, but there's so many things to do. I have to study all of this weekend, and it's just, I'm tired. Like, literally, I woke up at 1 today, Saturday, um, and now I'm getting ready to wash my hair because I took out my braids last night. It's now time to, like, just switch it up, so I took, the, took it out, but by the time I took it out, like it was really late and I couldn't, it was like one in the morning. But I did buy some new, I restocked and bought some new products. This is one of my favorites. It's the Afro Sheen Velvet Flow Leave-In. Um, it's a detangler, refresher, curl refresher and leave-in conditioner. And then we have this um, detangling pre-shampoo treatment. So this helps with detangling the hair. And then this is the new product that I bought. The Miel Twisting Souffle, um, and it smells, this smells so good, because I'm going to be twisting my hair, so. Hey guys, I know I literally just left you guys hanging from yesterday when I was doing my hair, but I ended up doing a twist out and using the new products, and I love the results, and my hair has grown so much, so I'm really happy about that, but that's not what I, ca that's not what I came here to talk about. What I came here to talk about was the fact that literally spring break starts on friday right when i leave school um so i'm really excited for that and today's sunday and i'm just getting ready for the week preparing myself for the week finishing up some homework and i'm gonna have like a little you know get like a little reset for school just prepare everything um tomorrow i have to present for biotech uh, my presentation and i think i'll do just fine i just don't really don't want to present but don't really have a choice about that and then on tuesday i have to speak at the assembly and I'm a little bit nervous for that. Actually, let me not lie, I'm really nervous for that, but because public speaking has never been like one of my strengths, but like I've always ended up having to do it 
regardless so but i get nervous um for these situations just because like looking at a whole audience like looking back at me kind of terrifies me but i have to do this it's only like two minutes and 30 seconds that i'll be up there so i'm just gonna read the piece of paper the little script that i have and i'll be going about my day um but that's happening and then on wednesday nothing is happening and then on thursday i have a math quest like a quiz and a test like combined and my english paper is due and it's also sophia's birthday on thursday so i'm excited to wish her a happy birthday but your present has not come yet sophia so by the time you're watching this it's probably going to be like april or may to be honest um it's coming uh you will not get it on your birthday though but anyways um what was i saying okay oh and then also on thursday i'm getting one of my college decisions back and then on Friday, I'm getting another college decision back. And then we're going on spring break. And I'm not having my party just yet. It had to be postponed just because of like things that started to come up in my timeline. So the party is going to be on April 8th. And I'm so excited for that. Um, it's not going to be really celebrating my birthday anymore. Although I do have birth uh, balloons that say happy birthday. So we'll figure it out. But I'm really excited for people to come over to my house and like throw my first house party there will not be any alcohol or any drug like i don't i don't do that <laughs> not that kind of house party but just like a really fun one and then i'm going somewhere for spring break so it's gonna be a destination trip we're gonna be vlogging all day all night i'm gonna get some really good footage because i've been really slacking for the past three months and you know i feel like spring break my mind will be clear i just well actually kind of because i get a lot of decisions during that time but we're gonna make the most of spring break and just like enjoy my last spring break of high school and then we're gonna come back to school and basically it's gonna be senior spring so it's gonna be pretty chill and then it'll be time to like worry about like prom and graduation and so many things and just like you know what i'm really excited for where everything's going so i'm gonna get on my homework and i'm gonna try to vlog the rest of this week before spring break comes and then you'll see all the action after that so Hey guys, so I just finished um, Mannequin, it's Wednesday, so I'm going home now, but we made so much progress with the book and it's actually pr due pretty soon. Pretty much right after spring break we have to submit it, so yeah. And it's Wednesday, meaning it's almost Friday and that means it's almost spring break, which I'm so excited for. And tomorrow is actually Sophia's birthday. I don't have her present yet, but um i'm still thinking about what to get her and she knows this so future sophia love you so much happy early birthday girl um and yeah so i'm just gonna go home now because walking and talking is just not it so i'll see you guys when i get home guys i just got accepted into another college i didn't get good news yesterday from a college but it, personally it wasn't my favorite so i wasn't like too upset about it but one that like I was really hoping that I got into. I got into this. Oh my god. Oh by the way, it's Sophia's birthday. I did not get any footage of that. But she looks so good today. Love you girl. Yeah, she looked really good today. And you know, her hair was curled and everything. She had a cute outfit on, wearing her special blush. So happy 18th birthday, Sophia. And I'm just really happy. And she also got into a school that she really wanted to go to last night. So she's just having a really great birthday and I'm having a great day today and everything is just, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Yeah. <laughs> Civil rights advocate, scholar and professor. Um, at 
in race and gender. Stop. I'm trying to not distract Thank you. you. Gender issues. Even if it's opera and it's Are you ready for spring break? I think it's that one, yeah. <laughs> Shut up.